We are a small business with strong connections to partners around the world. Each of us is multidisciplined. As a mechanical engineer myself, I spend the better part of my day working on sales and marketing via our website, but I also support application engineering, product development, and also our quality management system. Most of us have come from the large corporate world, so we understand the culture and the structure in which most of our uh, customers are working within. A typical customer would come to us with special requirements that uh, some of the bigger organizations don't want to address, such as uh, it could be a high temperature requirement, could be high precision, could be they need to fit it into a really compact space. And sometimes these larger corporations, they look at the volume behind the customer's request, and if it isn't sufficient enough, then they don't want to take on that business. But that's where our sweet spot is. We will take on that type of business. Some of the resources that set us apart from our competition is our network of technology partners around the world. We developed good relationships with some companies out of Europe and Asia, which have key technology that isn't available in the U.S. market, and we can capitalize on that technology and bring it to the market here for our customers. As far as our product mix, we distribute about 40% of our products from our partners and about 60% of that is what we manufacture or make right here in the United States. Well, a typical design project begins with the customer identifying a problem that they have in a, in a design and they're searching for a solution. Uh, they often find our website where we list you know, a variety of products that, that we, we make and um, they find something very similar to what they're looking for. And so they, uh, they give us a call and often the conversation is, I, f I see this product on your website and I need one of these, but, and then there's a problem. You know, they, uh, there's something where the, that standard item or the item pictured uh, will do the job except for where perhaps they need um, much higher temperature range or they need higher capacity or longer travel or something along those lines. And so with the, uh, with, with the but and then the explanation of uh, what they're looking for, uh, we begin a dialogue with them and uh, understand what they're looking for. Um, it might be, um, uh, you know, like I said, longer travel or something of that nature. And, uh, and so we begin the dialogue to ask them, what are you looking for? What kind of things will make your project successful? You know, what kind of timeline do you have? What kind of cost targets do you have? You know, these are things, you know, even beyond the engineering that are really important for us to understand to help the customer succeed in this uh, application.